I hate trying to be cute. Yo, me too. Me too. Yeah. Yes, like even when I was tying it, I'm like, you can. Look at this. I'm like, it's me up. Cause I was gonna say when I when I tied mine, it, it still looked like. It just looked like it was weird. I don't know. Graphic tees just be doing anything. Are we at six minutes yet? Yep. Yay. <laughs> my damn heel. What? You want to know what it is? Good. What it is, is my feet are a little sweaty. Plus, yeah, and it's probably hard to. It's hard to like grip. It's so cute though. Oh, thank you. I don't know where I got these at. Watch it, turn it, leave it, start format it, touch it, bring it, pay it, watch it, turn it, leave it, start format it. Who be the king of the sound? Uh -huh. What's the bus back? They just put a lock on the town. Uh -huh. Not on my bitches be coming for miles around. See, they be coming, cause they know how to go. Turn it up, now you know who holding the throne. Just give me the crown. Niggas still looking to try to give me your pound. Easy. That's gonna start it off for you. This is cookies. I'm Dinaj. I'm sure you met Lou Lemon, Pecan Pop. You're gonna meet Caramel Swirl, PB with no J, or with the J, Jelly with no bean, or with the business. It's honestly up to you. I need you guys to create your own ice cream names today as well. Touch it, bring it, pay it, watch it, turn it, leave it, stop from at it. Touch it, bring it, pay it, watch it, turn it, leave it, stop from at it. And as you start again, we bring in the bell. Uh -huh. When I come, I be doing it and doing it well. Uh -huh. Then I beat up the coochie and be making it swell. Trying to hide the smell uh -huh. of the sack. Praying on it. Turn it up. Then they try to walk with his truck. Don't know what could tell. Come on. Now a nigga got in their butt. Made everything tell. Come on. Now this chick a while like a nut. She I want some ice cream. Thank you. Say hi. Hey, what's going on? Hey. All right. It's regular. Is it really? I guess it's dyed pink. Wanna try it? You not gonna try nothing? Street niggas will strike it because my movement is strong. Come on, let me consistently rap and see my money is strong. Oh, my bitches just let me see. This is vegan, y'all. You done now? No, I probably didn't. Sign time. It's too crunchy, though. You like the crunchy? I love the crunchy. It's too hard. My teeth about to break. I ain't gonna have no front teeth. Bring it, pay it, watch it, turn it, leave it, stop from at it, touch it, bring it, pay it, watch it, turn it, leave it, stop from at it. And then just start again. Oh, hi. Oh my God, the boys, the boys. Let me know when. Yeah. Close my eyes? Yeah. Okay. Alright. My eyes are closed, but I'm recording, okay. but my eyes are closed. There you go. <laughs> Close your eyes. Oh, okay. it's right here. Close it's right here. Right here. Close your eyes, baby. Close your eyes. Alright, my eyes are closed. I'm gonna record what I'm gonna see. Alright. Eyes are closed. Right. Take 
like pictures? Are these real? Touch it. It's fake. This is so cute. Open me. Oh, I'm so nervous. Oh, look, it's the ice cream screen. Okay, that's cute. I'm a knock. Oh, who's there? I see wifey. Haters wanna fight me. I see who? I said haters wanna fight me. Oh, oh who this little white girl? The figure on the swing is Mary Lella's bum. Ain't nobody call you Otis. This is cute. on that Like pee. I'm gonna piss on you, piss on you. <laughs> Do you know that uh, song? No. Oh my god. The R. Kelly, oh, well, I don't know if it's R. Kelly. Two minutes and we're going to the tattoo parlor to get some fun stuff. Uh oh. 
They probably think we're part of a gang. Right, right, right. I don't know. Oh, I know. Right. Yeah. Any girl gang. They be like, nah, this, 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 this. All right. Did, did, did. Don't got no fresh pair. That's all you got. I got three glasses, y'all. As we're walking. As we're walking, we found some glasses. Okay, we got some. Y'all guess what it is? She in the prison too. You nervous? It's my oh. first time. You no, you ready? What? What? A 13 minute walk. So we gotta be out here by 3.15. About 15 minutes. Put the jewelry on them. Pick it or pull. I don't know. But y'all, I got some shades. I got some. Maybe I'll show y'all later. I ain't about to do that here. I don't like my colors. You don't like it? You know. Yeah, I love the yellow. And you can't go wrong with red. And then you have black. What? Uh. Like I don't even know what to pick, but we so far got um what is that the donut and so I don't know, but we got something and yeah. it's so nice. Ooh, nice! It's so nice. I can't wait to try it. I want to try it. It's hard.
that? Yes, it's ratio. I think it's SH. Yeah? Yep, SH. SH, okay. SH 4949. 4949? Four, four, yes, 1609. Oh. 1609. Ooh, ooh, that's Jersey. <laughs> Zardy Jersey. Zardy Jersey. Fantastic. Oh, fantastic. Oh, fantastic. Oh, fantastic. Oh, fantastic. Bye, miss. Oh, Thank you. You keys. Like oh. How do you say keys in Spanish? Uh, Javis. 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 Okay. Oh, right. Oh. No, no, no. no. <gasps> Okay, Miss. Thank you. Oh, Have a good say, night. Gracias. Oh, gracias. gracias. Buenas noches. Oh. oh. Okay, y'all. So I know y'all are probably so confused, and you're probably thinking, like, what the heck was that last clip? But basically, me and my sis got stuck in New York for a night, just overnight. But when I tell you this story, so crazy, so crazy. So I'm gonna do a quick, quick story time, and then I'm gonna end the vlog here. So basically what happened was we went to a few different spots as you've seen. But every time we went to a new spot, we had to end up getting different parking from different spots. Because it would only be like a three hour parking or whatever. So, okay, cool. So the last place we went to was Times Square. And we ended up booking somewhere like a spot that ended at, I think 12 a.m. was the garage. Like the garage time to come pick up the car. Mind you, every other place is till 4 a.m., 6 a.m., 24 hour, whatever. So we get there and the guy's like, are y'all going to be here? Like, are y'all going to be here before 12? We're like, oh, yeah, like, we definitely going to be here before 12 because we didn't think that we would be, you know, after 12 or whatever. So 
Anyways, child, what do we do? So we went to the bar, went to Times Square, whatever like that. So we're having a ball. Like, we're recording it. Like, having so much fun. It's so much fun. Like, it literally was something that you see in the movies. Like, I never went to Times Square and seen that. Like, them break dance and everything like that. Anyways, so I think it's like 11.53, right? I think Taylor gets a text or checks her phone. Or I don't know what made her check. Mind you, I didn't even know that the garage ended at 12 a.m. But I remember him asking, like, will we be there before 12? And we're like, oh, yeah. So, whatever. So, anyways, it was at 11.53. And I don't know. She got a text. She looked at her phone, whatever. She was like, what time do we got to be back at the garage? She looks at the ticket. It says 12 a.m. It's 11.53. And why does the GPS say that it would take us 13 minutes to get to the place? So we like, oh my gosh, like we don't want the car to get stuck, whatever. So we're like running down like New York City. Like we get there literally at like 12 o'clock on the dot or 11.59, something like that, whatever. So we we give the guy our ticket. We're like, okay, like my car is here. Da, 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 da. He's like, oh, like Nissan, like your car is not here. Like your car is like down there. We're like, but it says this address. He's like, but your car is down there. So we're like, oh my gosh, like at this point now it's like 12.01, 12.02. Cause we've been talking to him, giving him the ticket, like trying to figure out my car is there. He's saying my car's not there. So, we, like, go down the street, whatever, like that. Like, no parking, whatever. We're like, oh, my gosh, like, we must have, no parking garage. We're like, oh, my gosh, like, we must have missed it. So, we come, like, back to where, like, we thought my car was at, the address that it says it's at. And there's another parking garage, like, right next to it. So, it's, like, some foreign guy there, whatever. He's, like, Indian, whatever. And we're like, oh, my gosh, like, my car, this is the reservation, whatever. Long story short, he says, like, my car is not there either. So, he's like, well, wait. Let me, like, call my manager. He calls the manager. The manager um was like, oh, like, let me talk to them. So, my friend picks up the phone, like, takes the phone. There, she's explaining it. He's acting all confused, whatever. So, mind you, now we think that, like, my car is in a place that he said my car was not at. Because we're like, this is the address, though. Like, this is the address that it says at. And now you're saying it's not there. And, like, my car is here. So, now we're mad at the guy. So, my friend's like... No phone, like, no car, no phone. Like, you're not getting your phone back until you give us the car back. Like, you got something that we need, and we got something that you need. So, whatever. The guy's like, I'm going to call the cops, all this stuff, da 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 We like, you know what, all right. Like, now we got to abort the mission. Like, now you blowing my shit. Like, just leave my car. So, then we're like, oh, my gosh. Like, what are we going to do? Mind you, y'all, there's a plot twist at the end of this. So, make sure y'all just listening to all the stuff that I'm telling y'all. So, what happened? So, we're, like, going to Applebee's. At this point, it was, like, 1240. 1245 whatever we're like walking there's the applebee's they said they closed at one then we tried to go to a diner they said they closed at one like everything closed at one and i'm just like for someone or for people to say that the city never sleeps this city is sleeping like it's knocked out at 1 a.m like now i'm pissed because why is nothing open granted Times square is open like outside but obviously buildings have to close like businesses have to close anyways so i'll cause that and He's pissed. He's like, what the heck? Like, your car is, like, stuck in a garage. Da, da, da. And I'm freaking out. I'm just like, what the F? Like, he's drawing and saying my effing car not in there. Like, I know my car's in there. Like, open up the effing gate so I can get my car. Da, 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 all this stuff. So, we ended up, like, walking down Times Square because everything was closed. So, oh, another thing, too. So, another thing, I'm calling places. I'm like, at this point, like, we're going to have to get a hotel. Like, there's nothing we can do. We have to get a hotel. Calling up all these hotels. It's a Friday night. Every hotel is saying that they're booked. Like, I'm calling. I'm like, hey, do you have something available for tonight? No. Like, everything is booked. Mind you, the stuff that's not booked, they want like 500 a night. But I'm like, at this point, if that's what I got to pay, that's what I got to pay. It's 2 a.m. The garage don't open back up till 6. So, I'm like, what are we going to do for four hours? Like, I'm not about to sit out here and be a hobo. So, then what happens? Oh, so we're walking down Times Square, whatever like that. Mind you, as we're walking down Times Square, like, where all the chaos is, like, where they're, like, breakdancing and stuff still, everybody start running. I'm panicking. I'm like, oh, my gosh. Like, don't tell me they're shooting at Times Square. Like, I grabbed Taylor hand. Like, we're out. Like, we're running. Whatever. So, that already blew my stuff, too. Because I'm like, this is too much. Like, I don't have my car. Like, I don't know what y'all are doing. Like, y'all are running. Like, I don't know who's shooting, who's fighting. Like, I don't know. Like, at this point, like, I'm going to go home. I, I want to go home. I had a nice, I had a beautiful day, an amazing day. I love to hear. But now it's time for me to go home. Like, New York is not for me. So, then we're running or whatever. They, everybody stopped running. We ended up seeing cops on the side of, like, Times Square. Like, I guess they were, like, posted up. Who child, this story is so long. But hold on. Because my camera is acting weird. Hold on. 
All right, y'all, so I'm trying to remember where we was at. Okay, that's right. So we see the officers on the side of the road, and we start talking to the officers. We're like, look, the garage story, you know, da-da-da. And they're like, wow, like, that's crazy. Like, there has to be a way that, like, um, oh, there has to be a way that they can, like, open a garage or whatever. Like, they were, like, all on our side. They're like, wow. Like, saying all this stuff. We end up talking to the officers for, like, 15, 20 minutes. He's like, if I were y'all, like, I would go back there and then call the cops. Like, I don't know if the cops can do something. They probably can't if, you know, like, if the manager doesn't open up the gate. But, like, just go see what the cops can do. And at this point, I'm kind of like, I don't want cops to come for this parking garage stuff when there's, like, crime that needs to be fought in the city of New York. So, like, that was another thing. I'm like, I really don't want to call the cops because, like, they probably can't do anything. That's like your phone being, like, stuck in a Target or something and the Target is closed and you call the cops. Like, what is the cops going to do? Like, you got to wait for that establishment to open back up. Like, it's a business. Like, you just have to wait. So, we walked back down. Oh, yeah. So, the cops was like, oh, like, to go back to that parking garage, like, 0311 Street, whatever, is down that way. Mind you, I just told y'all we just came running from that way because we didn't know what they was doing, fighting, shooting, whatever. I didn't want to go back down that way. So, I'm like, I don't want to go back down that way. How about we, like, go down this way and then, you know, everything in the city is like a square. So, I'm like, how about we just, like, take a longer route, go down this way, then go down this way, then, you know, and we'll end up back on that street. Child, we walk in, and of course, New York and niggas, like, just being niggas. So, they're doing the whole catcalling thing, like, oh, oh, you look good. You know, like, y'all say that to everybody, but okay, go off, sis. So, they're doing all that, and at this point, I'm just like, all right, because I think when we walked down that street, it was darker because it was in Times Square, and it probably was, like, three men or something. I don't remember because, like, I just remember looking, and I'm like, all right, like, let's go. Like, just keep walking. Like, you don't stop. You don't, like, you just keep walking. Like, okay, yeah, thank you. Bye. Okay, see you later. Bye. See you later, alligator. And that's what I'm doing. Like, see you later, alligator. I don't want nothing to do with you. So I'm walking, but, like, my heart is starting to pounce a little bit because I'm just like, New York niggas can be very aggressive. So I'm like, oh, my gosh. Long story short, we're walking. They're still trying to, like, talk to us. And we're, like, just walking so fast. Like, walk so fast. What do I see? A hotel a hotel to my right so i'm like huh i'm like okay like just go in here like go in here so we asked them like the lady at the front, i'm like do you have anything for the night what did she say she says yes and i'm like wow like god is so good all the time all the time god is good then i'm like how much at this point i'm thinking like four or five hundred dollars i'm like this is going to like be a pretty penny y'all she said 150 I'm like, oh, that's a steal. Like, I get from my car so fast. I was like, sign me up. Like, sign me up. Put my credit card on the desk. Like, sign me up. So, she signs me up. Whatever. So, we get a hotel. And we're like, oh, my gosh. Like, at this point, it's probably like 2.30. So, we get into the, um, we get into the uh, hotel room. And I start tripping. I'm like, yo, like, the guys seen where we went. Like, they seen that we went into this hotel. What if they try to come up here? We were on, like, the fifth floor, I think. I'm like, what if they try to get us? Like, what if they try to find us? Like, I'm panicking. We put the, ele the elevator. We put the refrigerator up against the door. Like, we had the lock on the door. We had two beds in there. I'm like, I'm sleeping with you. I was slept with Taylor and everything. Like, I'm not beat. Like, y'all not going to get me. We are a package deal here. So, anyways... Um, oh, I was so nervous. I'm like, girl, what if they can hear us in here? Like, what if the guys are after us and they can hear us? Like, we need to whisper. Y'all, when I tell y'all, no BS, we were whispering. Because we were up for probably, like, another hour. Because we're just sitting there, like, in our misery. Like, wow. Like, we don't got no liquor. Like, that's in the car. We don't have nothing. Like, we're just sitting here at this point. Like, our drunkness is wearing off. Now you're getting a little tired, but, like... It's like 2 in the morning. Now that we got a place to stay, 2, 2.30 in the morning, I'm like, now that we got a place to stay, like, now I want the party to keep going. But I can't. I got to get up at 6 a.m. to go to the garage because I didn't know how long. I didn't know how much they were going to charge me. I didn't know if they were going to tow me. Like, we didn't know nothing. We're like, we have to get there, like, as soon as they open. Long story short, like I said, we were whispering. Before you know it, like, an hour goes by, we fall asleep. But throughout the middle of the night, we just kept waking up and, like, looking at each other and giggling. Oh my gosh, like... We're, like, really at this random hotel. It was a nice hotel. It wasn't, like, nothing rinky-dink. Um, so, we're, like, oh, my gosh. Like, this is so crazy. And then, like, I felt like I couldn't sleep because I just kept looking at the door. I'm just, like, I wanted to make sure the lock was still on there. Like, it was one of those, you know, hotel locks. I just wanted to make sure the lock was still on there. So, whatever. That's our whole night. So, let me tell you the plot twist. 
So then it's the next day. It's 6 a.m. in the morning. And we're walking. We get to the, the same place that we was at last night. Like, this is the address, you know. Again, same story. As you seen in the clip. Like, Nissan. Like, where'd you leave your car? Like, it's not here. We're like, they said it was here. No. They were like, oh, try that one down there. Try the one down there. My car wasn't there. Then they're like, oh, try the one down there. Try the one down there. And my car is there. Thank God my car is there. But we tried three and the one from last night. A another one from last night. If y'all remember me telling y'all we like went and then that wasn't it. We came back and it was one next to it. So we tried four parking garages and finally got to it. Now, let me tell y'all the whole time I'm mad at myself. Because usually I'll like send my location. Like when I park in the city, I'll send my location to like whoever I'm with. The reason why I didn't though is because we had a confirmation with an email. Like through email with the address. But I guess since it's at like 311 or whatever like that. It was like so many parking garages on 311 Street or whatever. Or, I don't know. Like, when we got to the parking garage that my car was at, it said it was, like, 350th or 350. I'm just like, how does it go from 311 to 350? But, okay, whatever. Go off. So, let me tell you the plot twist. The plot twist is we get my car. In the car, we get my car. In the garage that my car was at was not the one that we first went to that was on the address, if that makes sense. Like, that was on in the email saying that it was the address. My car was never there. It was at another garage. Like, the address was wrong through the email. Honestly, I was so pissed. I was so pissed because we were snapping at that guy. Like, you got my phone. I mean, you got my car in here. We got your phone. Like, we're not giving you your phone back. Like, we was really snapping. Like, he was about to call the cops. We did all this crazy stuff just for my car to be in a whole other garage. But wait, double plot twist. What if it never really closed at 12 a.m.? What if it was one of those 24, like, our reservation was till 12 but what if it was open till like 2, 3, 6 in the morning or whatever? We will never know. How will they know? Like, the girls will never know. So, that's my story. So, I'm sorry. My camera was running out of, uh, my memory card was running out of memory. And then I had to fix that. So, anyways, like I was saying, it was a double plot twist. But, I mean, at the end of the day, I just felt like maybe that's what was supposed to happen because who's about to drive back home at one in the morning anyway we drive we live two hours away so it's just like everything happens for a reason i'm happy that it was only 150 dollars, so that was good it wasn't all expensive so that was good so that is my story basically on how we basically got like stuck in new york for the night but besides that everything else was nice and i'm not gonna lie i was pissed when everything happened but then when i started thinking about it in retrospect i'm like we were we would have probably been like tired driving home. It was super foggy that day too. So I'm just like, I'm happy that I'm safe and sound and back home. Crazy story though, bro. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. I hope you guys enjoyed this short, little, long kind of story time. I would love if you guys can subscribe to your girl. Don't forget to subscribe, Yana. Don't forget to comment down below, like this video. And of course, I will see you guys in my next video.